A postal worker is moving some mail around an office building and summons an elevator. There's an overhead light in the third camera that flickers from the very beginning of the video onwards, which may or may not be an indication of something paranormal. Notice how this electrical disturbance briefly spreads to the elevator as soon as the doors open. So far this could just be a technical malfunction, but that doesn't explain what happens next. Watch as the papers start fluttering on their own despair there. Being no possible draft inside of the cramped space, I can't help but notice how the papers stop fluttering every time he looks over, only to resume again when he stops paying attention. It definitely looks paranormal to me. Again, the lights flicker on and off as soon as the doors open, almost as if a paranormal entity is getting on and off the elevator with him. He notices that the lights are flashing an awful lot down here, but he chooses to ignore it and keeps moving. A short while later, this phantom businessman partially emerges from a realm beyond our own. I have trouble believing this part is not computer generated effects, but that doesn't necessarily mean the whole video is fake. Maybe everything up to this part was real, and someone added in this final scare at the end. Or worse still, maybe I'm wrong and this ghost really was behind him. This video of a mysterious creature was published to YouTube by Real Ghost Official 007 in December of 2019. The video, taken in the lot of a gas station, shows a slender, spindly limbed creature standing on two legs. It is momentarily caught by the headlights of a passing vehicle before it darts off out of sight. It looks somewhat similar to the creature in a TikTok video that's coming up on this list. Perhaps it's of the same mysterious breed. It makes sense to me, but I guess it could be something else altogether. Do you have any other explanations? It's enough to keep me indoors. Three photos and videos were shared on Facebook in Indonesia, showcasing the same strange phenomenon in the sky. Posted by Mr. Potek in November of 2019, with a video credited to Sataiwan. The unidentified object was filmed in Aceh, backlit by a bright moon. This mysterious flying or floating object appears to just hang there at the side of the moon. The object isn't shaped like a flying saucer, but its origins are equally as mysterious, viewed at several different angles. I don't come any closer to recognizing what this object is. The local police were reportedly terrified by its appearance. Should they be? What do you think it is? This Phantom is Ready for High Tea. Published in January of 2022, Sylvia C. writes that she was quietly watching TV when her resident ghost startled up the tea kettle. The security footage shows the electric tea kettle in the kitchen, apparently turned on by the spirit. It shuts off and Sylvia enters the kitchen and asks why it put the kettle on. Spirit in the kitchen, what are you trying to tell me? Why did you do that? The spirit answers rudely in response by throwing a pot lid across the kitchen. Some viewers suggest to Sylvia to keep a detailed log of each of the paranormal events she experiences, including the date and time in her response to them. Others suggest having the house blessed to remove the entity. If you were in Sylvia's shoes, what would you do? I'd be looking to move as soon as possible. A highway patrol building in Truckee, California was unprepared for one of the scariest moments ever caught on CCTV, a surprise bear inspection. The animal gets up to look inside and pushes down on the extra large doorknob. It looks like an act of sheer luck but then it knows to pull the door towards itself to get inside, which is just creepy beyond belief. You can see from its reflection of the window that this bear gets pretty far into the station, approximately 29 seconds pass before it's spotted and chased. The curious critter nudges open the door to get away from two officers, and there really isn't much they can do except clear the parking lot and probably call wildlife authorities. The way this bear can open doors so easily seems well practiced and makes me wonder how many different human houses it's visited. Hopefully they catch it soon and relocate it someplace far away. This video was supposedly found on a deep web server under the file name EBE1992 Iger. EBE is short for 
extraterrestrial biological entity, and the uploader thinks Iger could be a mountaintop location in Switzerland. Obviously, 1992 refers to the year that this video was made. Anyway, what's especially odd is how the camera person moves around in a hurry as they record still photograph after still photograph of the strange gray alien. I get the impression that they were recording classified evidence from an area that they did not belong in. Powerful Pancake is the name of a YouTuber who decides to ring his neighbor's doorbell and then run away. He hides around the side of the house just in time, but his friend behind the trash can is not so lucky. Powerful Pancake doubles back to grab his camera and the chase is on. As you can see here, the neighbor comes charging down the driveway with a bat over his head, ready for who knows what. They barely make it to their car in time and speed off. I think this video is probably real because they seem to actually be full of adrenaline, and that is not easy to fake, but I'd like to get your opinion. Number 10. Two YouTubers see a suspicious red balloon tied around the grate of an old sewer tunnel and start to explore. It isn't long before their flashlight shines upon someone standing rigidly before them. No freaking... No! No, 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 no! The sewer lurker chases them down the entire length of the tunnel at full speed, and they barely make it out alive. Listen to this part and tell me if you think the fear in their voices sounds real, because it does to me. Ah! Oh, Franco! Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out! Get out. Ah! I hit my head! Who or what that was remains a mystery. There's been no update made since this video was uploaded. Mysterious things have been happening for years at the Haunted Brookside Theatre in Romford, UK. Management has long reported sightings of ghost orbs and furniture moving by itself across the floor with no one in the room. Footage of one such strange and unexplained event was captured on a quiet Sunday morning in 2014. Management came in to find the chairs were no longer in the same place as they had been the night before. They checked CCTV tapes already knowing the answer, but for some reason, even after all these years, there's no getting used to paranormal activity and so they check every time. A paranormal presence is shown on camera moving the chair and then the table. Half the table is off the camera, so that would be easy to move by yourself and say it was a ghost, but a chair moving by itself would be harder to fake, though it could be a string. I'll keep digging for more paranormal videos from the Brookside Theater so we can help solve the mystery and figure out if the building is really haunted. In the meantime, let me know what you think of these creepy moments caught on camera. A tech-savvy phantom is entering the chat. YouTuber Amitov Paranormal Tech YT went live on his YouTube channel and his REM pod activated. So he set up a security camera in the room at night. This is what happened. An invisible entity enters. And not long after, this happens. A light turns on and off. This footage is creepy for sure, but is it paranormal? Or can it be explained? I'm not sure, but I'm looking forward to seeing what Amitav captures next. Paranormal investigators Mindseed TV get schooled by the spirits while exploring this haunted elementary school. They enter into what can only be described as a spooky atmosphere. <laughs> That's a wolf, huh? Gotta be. Yeah, that's one way to start the night. As they walk around, the spookiness increases. Hey, seen it? Hello? Hello? No way. While they're examining the door, something appears in the floor grate below. Watch closely. Right away. Yeah. What was that? While the crew is downstairs, a static camera they left in the living room picks this up.
First, the horse toy moves around oddly on its own, and then a shadow figure appears to move away from it. Here it is again. What now occupies this haunted school? Well, I'm prone to thinking it's the former students. I'm sure there are other theories as well. What do you think is going on here? For more creepy videos like this one, be sure to check out Mindseed TV's channel. In the moment, you might not catch some unexpected apparition appearing around you. It's only when you play that moment back that you find it. Published by William Villas in September of 2013, he writes in Malay, This video was filmed on August 3rd, 2013 when we were waiting for the troops to have a video clip that was still unavailable. The video shows a group of men sitting and talking in the darkness. They appear to be sitting in a stairwell as they laugh, completely oblivious to what's going on around them. You see a girl dressed in white with long black hair and shoulders hunched forward pass by slowly at the top of the stairway. The men must not have noticed in the moment as they continue on as usual, but they sure must have gotten the scare of their lives when they watch this clip back later on, only to make this mysterious and unexpected discovery. Once you see the apparition, you watch it again, over and over, because you can't look away from it. D-Master Flex is camping overnight in a haunted cemetery. They get bored and let their guard down long enough to play a game. What the? You... What the? You... Yo, 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 hold on, hold on. The tower of Jenga blocks collapses seemingly all by itself. The tower was clearly built on a level surface, and there appears to be no strong winds to blow it over. I guess it could have just been a string, but if not, then this incident is almost certainly paranormal. Mike Tuttle and his friend Hunter are going to an abandoned trailer in the middle of the woods at 3 a.m. with a Ouija board to do a paranormal experiment. The creepy forest setting has them both nervous before they even begin. Alright, put your hands on. Let's go. <laughs> You're sketched out, won't you? Want me? Oh, yeah, yeah. me too. Alright, ready? Almost immediately, the evil demon known as Zozo makes his presence known by repeatedly spelling out its name. Mike and Hunter quickly try to move the pointer to goodbye, but it switches to no instead. They are frantically trying to figure out how else they can end this session and make the mistake of taking their hands off of the pointer too soon. That's when something happens to Hunter in particular. What the f dude? Stop f***ing with me. Dude, we're in the middle of nowhere. I gotta go f***ing get- I gotta go get help, dude. Like, what the f Hunter eventually wakes up with no recollection of what just happened. He thinks he just got here, so Mike shows him the Ouija board and the video to convince him otherwise. It's unclear whether Hunter was possessed or if he just passed out from fear, but both of their reactions seem real, so I doubt this is fake. Let me know if you think this was a prank or if something really happened to them that night at 3 a.m. As we've seen in past videos, animals often see things that we don't, and sometimes that can send chills down our spine. Published to YouTube in January of 2018 by the Bram Fam, the video starts out tame as the Bram Fam picks up a doghouse from the store. They each go about their day doing various things for the vlog, but once Bram T is home with her daughter, she starts hearing things inside the house. The uploader notes that their dog Milo started acting super spooked, staring in the hallway and outside their balcony. As you can see, the dog appears on high alert, unmoving and staring out into the darkness. He is then captured staring out into the hallway. When Louis finally returns home, Bramty says she finally felt relieved. Do you think this dog was sensing something or someone in the home? Should they, as Bramty suggested, have the house blessed? That way it hopefully be cleansed. A YouTuber named Big and Blonde is checking on a Ouija board that he and his friend left in the woods not too long ago. Something chased them out of the woods the last time they used it, and now they are returning to properly end the ceremony. 
Not even broad daylight could keep their fears at bay as they come across the same spot as before. Something feels extra wrong about this section of the woods, and moments later they see exactly why. Dude, oh my god, run, run, run! A figure dressed in black and white stomps down their way and sends them running. As they flee, the screams of what could be a girl's last moments on earth fill the forest behind them. I guess this person could just simply be one of their friends, or it could be some kind of supernatural force conjured by the Ouija board. If it is the latter, then I could only imagine it will grow stronger with each passing day until the session is ended once and for all. TikToker KittyK38, also known as Paranormal Nightmares on YouTube, continues to capture paranormal encounters in her home. This appears to be home surveillance footage in their living room. In the left corner, there is a chair with two supposedly haunted dolls on it. Watch what happens when Jamie enters the room. Upon noticing the chair tilting backwards, Jamie grabs a piece of wood and waves it behind the chair to check for any strings. He cannot find any, though. The chair finally returns back down and Jamie quickly exits the room. All this recorded evidence really aids to the legitimacy of this haunted house. What would you do if you lived in a house like this? I'd be sleeping with the lights on. A YouTuber named Signs and Signals goes ghost hunting at an old abandoned church he used to attend years ago. You know, this seems kind of creepy. I had some spooky things going here when I was a little kid. I've had strange feelings here when I was little. Things start to get weird when he enters the main area. I'm gonna try my best not to get the windows as much as possible just to keep from anybody pulling up because that only possibly anybody on the camera. Why is my camera spazzing? His camera is glitching out in a very rhythmic pattern, and it doesn't look like he's messing with the zoom at all. Eventually, he gets it straightened out just in time for the strange sighting to be caught on camera. There's no way to tell if this is one of the ghost hunters or an actual phantom sighting, but since the camera goes out of focus in a really weird way, I think it could possibly be paranormal. A man named Dubai7 talks to himself while returning to the home he was chased out of to get some supplies. He is trying to grab this container when he is found and cornered. The door slams behind him and he runs away. As he is looking into the room he just escaped from, a different door slams shut. And no one is inside the room when he checks. On his way out, he sees what I assume is his old cat watching him. The poor animal is too afraid to come near. It jumps away moments before something unseen chases him out the door. Now outside, he looks over just in time to see the window shutters open and close by themselves way too deliberately to be caused by the wind. Thank you so much for getting me to 40,000 subscribers here on my Clips channel. If you want to support, please press that subscribe button. Can you help me reach 50,000 subscribers? Thank you.